Holly Kupala from The Reader Girls, and I'm here in LA live with Jay Asher, and he's going to be telling us about this wonderful book, 13 Reasons Why. So, Jay, tell us a little bit about your book. 13 Reasons Why uh, is an susp emotional suspense book, is what I like to call it. It's about a girl who commits suicide, and she leaves behind cassette tapes detailing why, and her reasons why. And the second main character is a guy who's listening to these tapes and listening to Hannah explain these reasons and trying to figure out where he ends up on the tapes. And what, what was your inspiration? What made you want to write about this? Uh, I, had a, I had a close relative attempt suicide when she was the same age as Hannah Baker. And so it was always an issue uh, that was important I thought needed to be discussed more. Um, but the idea for the cassette tapes came after I took an audio tour one time. I thought that would be a great way to tell a story, but I was trying to find a funny story which needed to be told that way, and for years couldn't come up with anything until both of those ideas, the cassette tapes and the suicide, came, and then I just started writing. And what are you working on now? Can you talk about that? Um, I can't talk about it, but I will <laughs> talk around it. <laughs> I'm working on another book for teens. It'll be a little more lighthearted than 13 Reasons Why, but trying to focus on the interconnectedness of people and how sometimes that can be hard um, to really to really understand each other and the things that can be, come about by those misunderstandings. So what is the favorite book on your bookshelf right now? Uh, my most recent favorite read is Audrey Waite by Robin Fenway, which is a humorous book, so it's nothing like 13 Reasons Why. Uh, but it was actually edited by the same person that edited this. I don't know if that had anything to do with why I like it, I just there's something about the writing that you want to start. It's great. Very cool. Well, thank you, Jay, for thank you. being with Reader Girls. Thank you. All right, we'll be reading a part of 13 Reasons Why after Clay Jensen comes home and finds a box of cassette tapes on his doorstep. And he puts in the first tape and then... Press play. Hello, boys and girls. Hannah Baker live here, live and in stereo. I don't believe it. No return engagements, no encore. And this time, absolutely no requests. No, I can't believe it. Hannah Baker killed herself. I hope you're ready, because I'm about to tell you the story of my life. More specifically, why my life ended. And if you're listening to these tapes, you're one of the reasons why. What? No. I'm not saying which tape brings you into the story. But fear not. If you receive this lovely little box, your name will pop up. I promise. Now, why would a dead girl lie? Hey, that sounds like a joke. Why would a dead girl lie? Answer, because she can't stand up. Is this some kind of twisted suicide note? Go ahead, laugh. Yeah. Oh well, I thought it was funny. Before Hannah died, she recorded a bunch of tapes. Why? The rules are pretty simple. There are only two. Rule number one, you listen. Number two, you pass it on. Hopefully, neither one will be easy for you. At that point, Clay's mom walks in. 